This was the moment Bobby Wine returned home on Thursday after three days in custody for leading protests against a social media tax. Many of his supporters are young, drawn to his music and political views. Most have grown up with President Yoweri Museveni in charge. He's been in power for more than three decades. And so was the parliament. That father... Wine told Al Jazeera his supporters relate to him because of his fight against social injustice. We are lucky that we're living in a generation where our mouths cannot be shut. We shall speak the truth and we shall continue using the law as it is to stand for our rights. And has the president ever reached out to you? I mean, to talk about, you know, political issues, to talk about how to move the country forward and things like that? No, he has not reached out to me. And, and would you be willing to sit down with him um, to talk about what's ailing the country and what perhaps can be done better because he is the head of state? I would be very glad and very honoured to sit with the president and tell him exactly what I am saying now. I would honourably tell him that, Mr President, we need to respect the law. In another neighborhood, Isaac Wawira Stoll expresses his political stand. On a good day, he'll make about $5 selling this street food, but after expenses and home bills, he's left with very little to save or grow his business. They should reduce the price of wheat. The city council should also treat us well, stop harassing and overtaxing us. Hey. Like Wawere, a majority of Ugandans are young. Those we talked to said they don't have jobs, are poor and frustrated. Kampala is considered an opposition stronghold and Bobby Wine is very popular here. But some analysts say if you go to rural areas, President Yoweri Museveni is still family in control. These personalities aside though, people we've talked to say they're struggling to make ends meet and just want a better life. Government ministers say the economy is performing well, but not growing as fast as the population. So we have one of the highest rates of population growth. So in terms of absolute figures, we are adding on more Ugandans. And because of this high rate of population growth, it masks some of the achievements which we register. Back at the food stall, Wawira says he wants to move to a much bigger one and maybe one day a proper restaurant. But he tells us if things remain the same politically, he does not see his circumstances changing. Catherine Soy, Al Jazeera, Kampala.